was just playing around, Mom. I was just playing around. And I said, well, what, what were you doing? And he goes, I was eating a pizza, and, my, and the kid that crossed from me said it looked like a gun. So I picked it up and started shooting it in the air. Does the punishment fit the crime? That's a question a Rutherford County mother is asking tonight. After her son was disciplined for allegedly waving around a piece of pizza that some say looked like a gun. Good evening, everyone. I'm Ann Holt. And I'm John Dwyer. The mother says the boy was just fooling around with the pizza. The school principal says the child threatened other students. Andy Cordan has both sides of the story in this Nashville's News to Investigate exclusive. Nicholas Taylor goes to David Urey Elementary School in Smyrna. I think it's absolutely ridiculous. I mean, he was because the kid's just playing around. At lunch recently, the 10-year-old ate a slice of pizza that other students thought looked kind of like a gun. Perhaps something like this, designed by the Channel 2 art staff. The kid across from the table from him um, said, uh, it looks like a gun, so he picked it up, just kind of shot it in the air. Leanne Taylor says she learned about this when the school sent home a note indicating that Nicholas was in trouble. I got a note home saying that he threatened other students. My husband went and talked to the principal, and they just made a big deal about the fact that it was a gun. So what's Nicholas's punishment? He eats lunch with the other disciplined children at the silent lunch table and will do so for the rest of the semester. <laughs> so this little guy had a piece of pizza, he was eating it, and it looked sort of like a gun, and he said, hey, I mean, is that about what happened here? That's about what happened. Did he say, I'm going to shoot you or kill you, or did he say something no, derogatory or threatening? he did not. He did not. You asked him that? I did. And he said, I didn't say anything, Mom. I didn't say anything. Could there have been a miscommunication with the other kids there that felt threatened in some way? I highly doubt it. Yeah, I realize how it looks. It looks like a student's been punished because they had uh, a pizza that was shaped like a gun. That's that's not why this student's being punished, according to the principal. James Evans represents the Rutherford County School District. Some students reported that the student had made some threatening hand gestures to him, that he was shooting other kids at the table, and they reported it to a teacher. The principal investigated. The student didn't tell him the truth about it, and so he got a uh, silent lunch for six days. Evan says the punishment is minor, but the message being sent is clear. Uh, I, like I said, I realize that the people may say that we're going overboard, but the principal is just trying to use an abundance of caution and to send a signal to all the students that we don't play around about guns. It's not something you joke around about. He knows that he's not supposed to play with guns. I mean, we don't own a gun in the house. We don't have a gun in the house. I mean, he plays with lightsabers. He's a big Star Wars fan. Andy Cordan, Nashville's News 2 Investigates. Now, in addition to his silent lunches, Nicholas spent time with the school resource officer learning about gun safety. According to Mrs. Taylor, the school has made it clear that Nicholas will face suspension if the incident happens again.